ladies and gents, I am the Rev, and we are back with more Osiris New Dawn. You guys smash that like. So I deliver, and if you want more, keep hitting that like button. Subscribe, tell your friends. Now, in this episode, um, what we're going to do is we're going to go in and we're going to build our base, right? We're going to build this thing right here. Hopefully, I got enough materials. Found a couple of different ways to uh, trick the game the way the devs have it set up right now which might be helpful. So let's get into it. Let's build our base. As you can see, I haven't built anything else yet. Just my dude here. I am already at the site where I think I'm gonna build my base because it's surrounded by mineral deposits. Here we are. And something I noticed. Oh geez, big windstorm is coming up. Um, you mine better and you can run around better, get a better idea of the terrain if you make a point of keep it in third person. Now, we gotta go into our build menu, structures, the big dog. I suppose this will work. Now, next thing you need to do, normal walls is what we're going to build. Right, that's the cheap one. I'm not going to build them all the way so that we can hopefully get all of this built. Heavy wall, huh? Tungsten, don't have that. very good chance we're not going to have enough stuff to make what we need to so i'm trying to conserve and we can always take these walls down whenever we want right now it's just about getting the cheapest thing up that we can before the bugs come for us We can see it takes a lot. And it took me probably, oh, two or three hours to get all these materials. And we'll show you guys how I did it, though. Not real hard. Now, did the roof automatically... Oh, no, the roof didn't. Got a coupler ceiling. A regular one. There we go. And now we've got a. Hopefully, we have enough. Uh, structure. Ah, our airlock. This has always been the one that was a pain. Get into place. Drop down, you stupid thing. We not use our, I guess we can't use our jet pack. There we go. Huh? Huh. 
Now you might think, hey, we're good. Not yet. We've got to fill in these. And I'm already out of aluminum. Son of a... And we can't go in now. That was nice. I can't believe I went through all of that. I had 50 of everything. Well, not the titanium. I had 50, oh yeah, titanium, iron, aluminum. Now I'm gonna keep getting hurt. Copper, that's okay. See our hut's only 600 some odd miles away here. Not miles, but we'll go into third person and just run back over there. Now while you're running, you can see I've pulled this up here on the right side. That will show you where we can get more materials, which is what we gotta do. We got fringe showing up. Alright, we're a lot closer to our base than I thought. We don't want to go into this pit. Base is on the other side of it. And it kind of works, the jetpack. Not real well. But you can hear what's behind me coming. Strong. Did a little experimenting, got to sit myself where I usually can survive most of the time now. In here, put up a rock wall. Got uh, electric fence. Still got our debris hut. Now we can build a um, another one of these huts over at that new spot, but I'm trying.
Okay, so when you get to this point, looks like it's getting dark. There's too many guys around us. Now this messes up the spawning. What you can do is go back to the main menu. It'll save everything. And then you can just jump back in. And as you can see, we're jumping back in. We're on day 14 now. But it basically resets the day and the weather and all the bugs that were around us. We've got a little bit of nasty weather coming in. But then, this is when, again, you go into third person. This is what I've been doing. This is how I've been farming. See, now right here it says, and I showed you guys in the first video, there should be a bunch of stuff. See? None of it has respawned here. Now, I don't know if that's a bug or what, but the things you should be going after, first and foremost, are these. You can eat them or turn them into bandages. Keep your eyes open for upper left corners. There's no more resources gatherable. Now, every time you start wailing on stuff, you're going to be bringing, or you're making enough noise that bugs are going to come find you. So then we just move right on. We're looking for the big leaf, not the small leaf plants. But... See, there's another... Ah, here we go. And they're usually by... Uh, they're either by themselves or in weird spots. Um, usually by trees. The, these right here, large leaf plants and... The berries give us, um, bandages. Now, this is one of the mining spots. You see our base is right over there. That's where that is. And it's directly to the left of this bad boy. Okay. We're going to go in here. We're going to see how far we can get because you think you get overwhelmed outside where do you see this all right so in here this is one of the uh old ones that they had always want to look in the sample racks because maybe one day they'll put something in them Come over here Turn on the power. Then you want to look in all these crates. Over here on the ground, you're going to find carbon and copper every time. But I don't know if these respawn. I haven't been in here yet. Hey, if the dev devs were being true to form, what they should do is we should be able to uh, take this apart with our tool, but we can't. There's none in these, I don't think. There wasn't when they first did this, so... Okay. We're gonna get overwhelmed probably pretty quick here. We got a couple of ways we can go. Down here, as you can see, there's a crap ton of guys. There's crates and some minerals. Oh, hi there. I didn't think you guys could get up here. Oh, no. Oh, they're never going to stop, are they? Well, you need a gun. We'll get there. Sure keep getting a lot of useless crap. Vitals are now critical. Uh. 
Oh, Jesus. There's more down here. What else is down this way? Okay. And they're all coming. Here we got. immediately God, did I kill them all finally? Yeah, until more surface here. Which is what just hit me in the back. are now critical what in the hell keeps hitting me <laughs> all right so whatever's coming after me under the ground that I can't see which I'm That was the thing I really needed. coming through the walls. Vitals are now critical. Let me see, I can make a whole bunch of these. Since we just got... Oh, no, it won't let us make... Man why, why won't let us make bandages? That's weird. You're going to know she get a lot of extra tools that you just don't need. Now, I want to keep one of those. All right. All right. Maybe we should. We've got room now, right? There you go, guys. You got a good idea of what's in this one. So what we're gonna, what I'm going to do is run around and go get uh, the rest of the supplies I need to make um, to finish our, the basic for our base, and then I'll show you guys what that looks like to end the video. And from there, it'll be up to you guys what we do next. If you guys want to keep seeing more. Or not. Let's see, put those right there. All right. Woo. Had to burn a lot of them. All righty, guys. Finally made it back. Ooh. So until you get the base uh, completely made and powered. Uh, 
um, it doesn't show up on your maps. You have to remember where you put it. Easier said than done, my friends. But we're almost there. And then we just got to put some power on this bad boy. Yep, doesn't have any power yet. And that's my... And that is why... Let's see. Sounds are that... I don't know. We can put it right here, I suppose. Uh, no, that's not it. Inventory. Where is my solar thing? I Come on, I put one in here. There we go. Now that should give this power. And it's still not getting power for some reason. Oh, there we go. We had to do that. All right. So now that we're finally safe, it doesn't affect our, our hydration or anything else. The next thing we need to do We're gonna need is a utility and it's going to be and it's not unlocked yet okay so skills now, I've been busy with the skills as you can see over here the more mining you do the better your engineering gets but that's not the really super important one science right here we need 14 crap Okay, so that's the main fabrication, and once we do that, we can do things like build weapons, build better weapons, all those things. So you guys are going to want to turn in. I'm going to go outside and basically dig sand until I get this, and that'll be incredibly boring for you. So tune in next time, and I'll show you guys what you get when you upgrade your specifically fabrication, because that's there's one there. Hmm. Crab walker. A nice crab. Um, oh, and where's the other? Because there's a souped up version of it too, I think. But yeah, once we do that, then we're going to see about making a hovercraft. But to do that, we have to build lab construction. And to give you an idea, laboratory. Takes steel, wire, I've already got the wire, aluminum, I've already got the circuit boards, lithium, and gold ingot. And I showed you guys how to get all of that, basically. So that'll, that'll be what we work to in the next episode. I'm going to work on, and also, we need to get an inflatable dome kit. Especially if we're going to ever go off planet. But I'm going to work on getting the laboratory, and then, like I said, I'm going to go outside and dig sand. So tune in next time, and we shall kick a little ass. As always, I am the Rev. Keep your heads down. Your blades of doom. Up and all. See you again real damn soon.